What's up, YouTube? This is your girl, Comedic Medium Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. If you're new to my channel, I am a prophetic tarot reader. I do not read cards based off the meanings. I read cards based off what spirit tells me, the holy angels and the divine, the visions that I get. I am also a psychic medium. I am able to connect to those who have crossed over. I also come on here where I talk about the end time of the government, preferably the end time. Excuse me. Love, life, relationships, whatever God puts on my heart, mind, body, and soul. And I'm going to do a quick reading for Pisces. 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 Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, please give me three oracle cards for, for Pisces. Moonology. What's going on with my Pisces? Archangel Michael, Archangel Raziel, Archangel Raphael. Please give me clear and precise messages for Pisces. Somebody could have just recently moved because I'm seeing boxes. I'm seeing a U-Haul. Somebody could have just got evicted out of their home or they're going to be. I'm hearing somebody might get their door kicked in by the police or they're going to be. I'm hearing in three to five days, three to four months. What is this spirit? It says balance spirituality and practicality. Somebody needs to balance out their spirituality. You could be dealing with a look. You could be de most definitely dealing. Look, Pisces. Look, you could. So you could be a Pisces dealing with a Pisces. It says it's time to take action. Adjustments are required. Ooh. What's this spirit? This just fell out. The energy is gaining momentum, so whatever going on, this is something that's happened. Something could have happened at nighttime, or this is going to, whatever event I'm about to pick up on is going to happen at nighttime. The answers you need are coming. Your dreams need a practical plan. So what is going on? What is this? What is this? So that, so these could just be some quick messages. Excuse me. These could be some just quick messages for you, Pisces. You know, this may not resonate. This may just be... uh. Excuse me, this may resonate, this may not resonate, this may just be something that you need to know that may help you, Pisces. So it says, balance spirituality and practicality. It's time to take action. You could be dealing with an Aries, another Pisces. It says, adjustments are required. Your dreams need a practical plan. The answers you need are coming and the energy is gaining momentum. So what I'm feeling with this reading already is I feel like somebody could have recently had to move or they could have gotten evicted or something like that. That's what I'm hearing. And I'm seeing it. I'm, I'm seeing like somebody hold their chest, like somebody can't breathe like that. So somebody could have had like some type of nervous breakdown. I'm hearing, so somebody could have been working in cahoots with other people. Angel number 303 on the clock, Pisces. Somebody could be working and could have been working in cahoots or, or, or with, with others. I'm hearing drug trafficking. Somebody could be on the run from the police, the federal government or something like that. But I'm seeing somebody is getting evicted. Yeah, this could be a king of pentacles. Somebody that's getting evicted could be this king of pentacles. I'm hearing street pharmacists. Yeah, this king of cups, king of pentacles, king of cups. This could be... This could be a same-sex relationship, or this could just be somebody that's in a uh, a heterosexual relationship, like a marriage. But what I'm seeing is somebody is finna get evicted, or something. I'm seeing a U-Haul, so somebody could be. If this person is not getting evicted, somebody is having to move out of a home like really, really fucking fast. Cause I feel like this person could be on the run, or something like that. Somebody is wanting to come towards you to reconcile. That I'm seeing. This could be an ex of yours. This could be a family member. I'm hearing uncle. This could be a uncle. Yeah, somebody is wrapped up in the justice system. Somebody has did some type of illegal activity, some type of, um, I'm hearing illegal drugs. I'm hearing drug trafficking. I'm hearing cars. I'm hearing something. Somebody has done something illegal to gain this abundance. This could be a married couple. Yeah, because this the, well, we have this empress here. So this could be a wife. This could be a mother figure, some type of mother figure I'm seeing. Yeah, somebody that's, um, 
I'm seeing what I'm seeing is is that this King of Pentacles could have kept secrets from this mother figure. This could be a, a actual mother or a wife or something like that. And I I'm seeing somebody like hyper ventilating. I'm seeing somebody like throw up in the bag. I'm seeing blood come out of somebody nose. So somebody may do cocaine or something like that. Somebody may spend a lot of money on cocaine, some type of opiate, some type of pills, lean weed, some type of drugs. Yeah, yeah, Spirit is saying this is an ending to whatever is finna that's going on. There is about to be an ending. I'm hearing this is going on in real time right now. Yeah, 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 like this, this, whoever this mother figure is, because I'm heavily feeling like this is a wife. This could be several women. This could be a mother. This could be a wife that's a part of a family. Somebody that's women that could be connected to this King of Pentacles, this King of Cups. I feel like this person, this, this I feel like this is a male who's very wealthy, who has a lot of money. Who's gained a lot of wealth, a lot of generational wealth, abundance. Uh, yeah, a lot of fucking abundance. This person may, this man or masculine or female may take care of a family, a women in a family or something like that. But I feel like this, 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 excuse me. Ooh, excuse me. I am not trying to be gross, y'all. Y'all see I'm drinking something. I hope y'all didn't hear me burp. I need to stop drinking when I'm recording, but I, y'all, my throat be dry. But anyways, what I'm seeing is, is that this King of Pentacles, King of Cups, it, this man, masculine, it, this does not have to be a masculine, but I'm heavily seeing it's a masculine. This King of Cups is somebody that's very loving and caring. I'm hearing the type of person that get to give you their shirt off their back. I feel like this man may try to portray themselves to be a low key. So this man actually may have like a regular job or something like that. But I'm 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 hearing the nighttime. I'm hearing that song again is the right time. So this man may do a lot of like a uh, sneaky ass shit a lot of fucking dirty ass shit in the at nighttime this man is a heartbreaker somebody that breaks hearts i feel like this man i'm hearing that song back lady you gonna hurt your back dragging all them bags like that i guess nobody ever told you all you must hold on to is you is you oh yes it's true one day he gonna say yes okay thank you thank you spirit what i'm hearing is is that this empress this could be a wife to this king of pentacles this is somebody that's very insecure somebody that's afraid to be alone somebody that's uh has low self-esteem somebody that's not that, that that's very codependent somebody that, that, that cannot take care of themselves so this could be this 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 baby mama this wife this mother figure or this could be several women in this this masculine family but i feel like this main this wife or whatever baby mother whatever they could be hyperventilating i'm seeing somebody hyperventilate because i'm seeing somebody is about to go to the nine of pentacles all the way down to the five of pentacles and that hasn't even came out yet i'm seeing somebody's gonna be like hella broke i'm hearing like homeless on the streets maybe even having to sleep outside yeah i feel like this is a married couple that's what i'm seeing yeah because whoever this king of pinnacle is the everything that they've manifested is it's like it was a temporary fix i'm hearing a temporary high i'm also seeing that this masculine angel number 808 on the clock i'm also seeing that this fucking masculine is fucking yeah like they i'm seeing everything that this masculine has manifested it was off of evil greed this this masculine is demonic. I feel like this masculine has two faces. They may wear a certain mask like they're a goody two shoes and they're a good person. But this masculine has done a lot of backstabbing, betraying, has done a lot of evil things to get the money that they have. I feel like this masculine is on some type of, this masculine is on the run. Yeah, look, I can't make this up with this chariot card. This masculine is on the run. I'm seeing like man y'all this is what i'm seeing in my head i'm seeing a whole channeling this fucking masculine i'm seeing somebody like drive up to their driveway hit the garage door button the garage door go up and i feel like i'm seeing like i'm seeing a masculine having to call their homeboys their friends to try, help them get all their furniture and shit out their house i'm seeing a karmic this could be a karmic doesn't have to be I'm heavily seeing a karmic wife or feminine that's hyperventilating, throwing up in a bag, nose bleeding. I feel like this this married couple could do a lot of heavy cocaine or something like that. 
they could do a lot of drugs. I'm seeing a lot of tantric sex. But what I'm seeing is, is that this, this, this feminine is like hyperventilating. They can't breathe. I feel like because this feminine is codependent, I feel I'm hearing livelihood. So I feel like this masculine could be facing some type of jail time. I'm hearing fed, a federal case. Somebody could be facing some type of fucking jail time. And like whoever they're married to can't take it because I'm hearing my money is going to be gone, my livelihood. But I feel like not only, I feel like this, I feel like whoever this empress is, this baby mama, this wife I'm hearing, and I feel like this person is only coming out as an empress because they're married to this king of pentacles, but they're really karmic. Whoever this person is, they're not necessarily hyperventilating and throwing up and nose bleeding and shit because about necessarily this ten of pentacles, that too. But I feel like this is the type of female that fucking suck anybody. So it'd be easy for them to get another man to take care of them. I mean, you know, there are there are types out there who don't give a fuck about breaking bread to a hoe. So I mean, I, I'm pretty sure they can do that because I'm hearing work my jelly so this this feminine know how to work their jelly know the right words to say to a finesse to finesse a nigga out their pockets but i'm also saying that this feminine is tied old and through by a bad bill body bill pussy wore out loose you know that don't got so i feel like this feminine ain't got too much more uh pussy mouths on they pussy and i ain't trying to be vulgar i'm just keeping it real they don't have too many more mouths. Yeah, this emperor is finna go away for a very, very long time. And this, 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 I'm hearing work my jelly. I don't even talk like that, but that's what I'm hearing. This emperor is finna go away for a very, very fucking long time for being in this devil energy. This emperor is finna go away for wearing a fucking mask. Yeah. This emperor could have betrayed somebody, several people in the past, or this could be current energy I'm hearing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this emperor is very fucking low vibrational, very fucking low vibrational, fucking demonic, devilish. I'm seeing this emperor could have a demonic bloodline. This emperor, I'm here, I'm seeing that this emperor is somebody that's actually financially cursed. And the reason why they have the, I don't know why I'm seeing belly in my head. Y'all know, okay, y'all know DMX. I love DMX. DMX got a song called Let Me Fly. And in that song, go listen to that song if you able. In that song, you know, he's like, uh, I sold my soul to the devil and the price was cheap. Oh, yo, it's cold on this level, but it's twice as deep, but you don't hear me. So basically, you know what I'm saying? DMX was talking about how he sold his soul. I feel like, but yeah, oh, Lord, I'm seeing too many downloads. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Jesus, there's too much going on, Lord. Ooh, okay, look, look, y'all. Okay. Okay, I whew, I'm seeing I seen like three, four, five downloads at once. This fucking King of Pentacles, this motherfucker is on the run. This motherfucker, I'm seeing somebody like open their garage door. I feel like this could be happening in right now or the next two to three days. This this masculine is on the run. I feel like they're finna go into hiding. Like I feel like they're being heavily fucking watched. Like, they're having to move all their furniture out. They're having to ask their homeboys and friends. I feel like somebody didn't set this fucking masculine up. That's what I'm seeing. I'm also seeing that somebody is going to actually experience a death. There's not going to be a physical death to the situation. Somebody going to die. I'm hearing car wreck. I did a reading on my channel a while ago. I think it was for cancer. I don't know. But I, 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 I said that two twin flame males, one survived and the other one uh was living but i said i said two karmics two two oh my god y'all look i did a reading on my channel and i'm sorry to be all over the place but if you could go look up that reading i talk about it's a reading on my channel go look at my videos where i talk about it's two twin flames masculine it's two masculines that have a twin flame both of these masculines did not go towards their divine feminines. They chose a karmic demonic lifestyle. What spirits showed me in that reading is, is that these two masculines both had karmics. And the karmics that they deal with, they had threesomes with them or something like that. And spirit told me they all went to a convenience store and they got like beer, they got liquor, and they was going to all go back to a hotel room to have sex. The two karmics and the masculine. But... When they when they got back in the car, the, the two feminine stayed in the car and the masculine in the back seat stayed in the car. The only person that went in the store was the, the, the other masculine. When they when the masculine fourteen fourteen on the clock, when the masculine got back in the car, they all hit a line of cocaine. Coke, uh uh miachi. 
Spanish, right, Miyachi? Yeah, but they all hit a line of coke and like on their way when they when they drove out the damn parking lot to the store, they all got like hit by an 18 wheeler and the only masculine that survived was the masculine in the back seat. The front the, the masculine in the front and the two karmics, they both died instantly. But who the, the masculine that survived ended up being like paralyzed from the waist down. So I think I'm picking up on this energy. So I don't know. So I feel like this fucking karmic and another karmic so it's a bunch of people a bunch of energies in this reading they're gonna be on the fucking run somebody right now in this time as i'm speaking like right now they're they're like basically i'm seeing like a masculine and a bunch of people helping this masculine get their stuff out of their house they trying to i'm seeing some masculine could be trying to hide money underground but i feel like this is this masculine karma i'm speaking on somebody twin somebody twin betrayed a divine feminine this is i feel like i'm seeing a movie belly in my head and y'all know when dmx he sold his soul to the devil like i feel like this masculine is financially cursed because this masculine did not choose a divine path this masculine chose greed money fortune fame they sold they sold to the devil and the price was cheap and i feel like now the devil is ready to fucking collect because you got to pay the piper and this motherfucker don't want to get it up i feel like this masculine may owe a lot of people money like this motherfucker did not choose their divine path they chose to be fucking demonic and so this is their karma and i'm hearing this masculine if this masculine don't die but i'm hearing whoever i'm picking up on and I don't even want to call this motherfucker divine. This motherfucker is just a karmic masculine. I feel like this motherfucker is going to die. I feel like there's going to be a death. I'm, I'm actually seeing a grave site. I'm actually seeing a funeral in my head. I don't know what the fuck I'm picking up on. But I'm seeing this. This could be connected to that reading where... Yeah, this is too much. Okay, what's up, spirit? What else? Mm. Yeah, what else, spirit? There's this karmic, this feminine is high. Somebody is, has been hyperventilating. Somebody could be possibly having a drug overdose because I feel like whoever this feminine is, this wife, this baby mother, whoever this is, they're so sh distraught and scared that they finna go to jail too. But I feel like it may be an act. I feel like it's an act. This damn feminine actually could have set this this masculine up with friends or some shit like that. This this motherfucker could be faking. So this feminine could be like fucking faking like they're distraught and, and all of this shit. But this damn feminine, this feminine could die of an overdose because I feel like this feminine feminine may not really be distraught this feminine damn this is a lot going on i don't know this shit weird this feminine may not really be fucking distraught over this mask and this this feminine could be working with other people to to destroy this emperor to destroy this 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 is too much oh my god what the fuck am i picking up on this this fucking feminine could be working with other males or whoever to go against this emperor your emperor this divine masculine or something like that to try to steal so this this feminine could have been still actually stealing money from this emperor yeah this feminine is backstabbing betraying i feel like all, all i'm seeing is is that this married couple this woman this woman is a snake this woman this woman is working with other people to try to destroy this masculine. Yeah, this king of cups that will give you the shirt off their back. This motherfucker, it's like, it's just too much shit going on. Like, this is like way too much shit going on. I'm seeing that somebody, I feel like there's going to be multiple deaths in the next three to four months, three to five years, three to five days. Somebody finna die in a car wreck. I'm seeing a funeral. I'm seeing double funerals. I'm seeing, I'm, I'm hearing it, what I'm hearing in my head, these people, these group of people, this, this king of pentacles, this feminine, these motherfuckers sold, they sold to the fucking devil. That's what I'm hearing. They sold, they sold to the devil for financial gain and they think they finna get away. But as you know. When you sign your name in blood or you sell your soul to the devil, the devil is going to fucking collect you. Y'all remember when Prince died? Prince was like, don't pray for me. Don't pray for me when I die. Y'all, y'all, ooh, somebody don't want me to get this reading. Now, y'all see how my phone just dropped? And I ain't even push it. But y'all, when Prince died, Prince was like, don't pray for me. Yeah, I'm sorry. I just seen some on my TV, y'all. But yeah, Prince was like, don't pray for me because Prince knew he sold his soul. He knew that the devil was going to come collect him. You know what I'm saying? Like, so I basically, these people think that they're going to fucking run away from, from, from what they did. I'm hearing, 
motherfuckers is finna go to jail and i'm heavily seeing that there's gonna be double funeral funerals there could have been like a double homicide or something like that this king of pentacles could have got somebody killed a female or females or this group of it's a bunch of people involved in this is people everywhere these females could have set these females could have like set up niggas or something like that Y'all, I'm sorry. I keep seeing some. I seen some on my TV, and it kind of like threw me off. That, anyways, I'm sorry, you guys. But yeah, these fucking karmic females or whatever, they could have been setting up niggas to get them killed. Like this is just a bunch of energy. But I'm hearing everything that's going on. It's happening in real time right now, like real time. Somebody is on the fucking run. I'm hearing that song by Jay Z and Beyonce. On the run? Is that how it go? I don't know the... I hear sirens, will we make love? Loud as hell, but they don't. Oh. Mm. I don't care if I'm on the run. So I feel like, yeah, I feel like this, this king of pentacles and this fucking wife baby mama something like that this month they're finna go on the fucking run or they are on the fucking run but let me tell y'all a quick little story for this video cut off for those of you who do not know and maybe i need to make a video on this but i'm gonna just say it real quick fast in the hurry Aaliyah, the r&b star who died in the plane gra crash she was the real Illuminati queen. I know there's a lot of people that are big Beyonce fans, and I don't have anything against Beyonce. I'm just more of a Leah fan. Aaliyah was supposed to be the Illuminati queen, okay? Um, Aaliyah, when she died, she was worth $40 million. Destiny Child was worth like nine. Aaliyah did not want to sell her soul. Aaliyah, actually, when she was with fucking R. Kelly... You know what I'm saying? Her parents actually set that up to protect her from pedophilia in the industry. Angel number 2121. I'm going to have to come on here later and do a video on her. But um, anyways, to make a long story short, she ended up leaving her uncle's record label, which was Black Ground Records, the same record label that R. Kelly was signed to. Her uncle is married to Gladys Knight. That's her great aunt. So yeah. But anyways, Aaliyah ended up leaving him because she wanted to be free. She wanted to get to the top of the pyramid. She wanted to be you know, mainstream. She wanted to grow. She wanted to grow. So she left and she ended up going towards jay-z jay-z was messing with her and also damon dash was messing with her jay-z was really in love with her but jay-z was messing with other women and he was looking for somebody to be the the next illuminati queen since whitney houston had got on drugs and whitney houston was starting to die out you know she wasn't the illuminati queen no more so jay-z he didn't he really didn't want to sacrifice Aaliyah because that was his heart go look go watch that video song cry she loved him she had his heart you know he loved her he had he had you y'all get what i'm trying to say he loved the leah dirty job he didn't want angel number 222 on the clock he didn't want to fucking sacrifice her so to get so Aaliyah started messing with his right hand man dame dash and so a lot of people say oh he was hurt and this then the third i don't believe that damon dash didn't give a fuck about her he didn't give a fuck about her he only started caring about her till after she died and everybody know dame jazz really like white women and then after he died after she died in that plane crash he ended up talking her back to the female he was messing with and cheating on her with before he got with Aaliyah. I hope I'm making sense. I'm getting somewhere with this story. But every all I'm trying to say is, is that, listen, Jay-Z, and Jay -Z, Aaliyah was an earth angel. Aaliyah was a divine feminine, okay? She didn't want to sell her soul. She knew that she had, in order for her to keep to stay on top, in order for her, she didn't want to cross over. She didn't want to do that. So they had to take her up out of here. So Aaliyah, her name means the highest, the most exalted one. Beyonce was second in line. Not only was Jay-Z cheating on her with other women, one of the main women he was cheating on her with was Beyonce. The difference between Beyonce and Aaliyah, a, a Beyonce parents groomed her to become the Illuminati queen. They groomed her for what that was. A lot of people, they won't speak on this, but a lot of people was jealous of her. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying this to say is that whoever this twin flame is, whoever this fucking masculine is, if this divine feminine or that you could be, that you connected to, this motherfucker chose a fake divine feminine, a karmic, this, oh, y'all finna be mad, all you Beehive fans out there, this person chose a Beyonce, they didn't want an Aaliyah, and for y'all may condemn me in the comments and get pissed off at me, but Aaliyah was the real Illuminati queen, and y'all can go watch her, if you go type in Aaliyah death on Wikipedia, it says that she died from a blow to the head, 
But how the hell would they know that? They say it says on her book on the on book it says Aaliyah death, and it says on Wikipedia that Aaliyah died from a blow to the head. It says she was arguing with somebody on the plane and she died from a blow to the head. How would they fucking know that? How would they know that and everybody died in the plane crash? One person survived, but they end up he ended up dying in the hospital. I, I think they killed him. But spirit want me to stop right there. Whoever this is, this this like okay when you go when you go listen to that song, I hear sirens when we make love loud as hell, but they don't know. I don't know the words, but what I'm saying is, is that fucking, I think a siren is some type of animal or devil or something. I have to look it up. Y'all go look that up. But basically, Jay-Z and Beyonce, they, they sold their soul. Now, just because you joined the Illuminati don't mean that you have to sell your soul, but they... Fortunately, they did. They are the Illuminati queen and king of the industry. Aaliyah did not want to do that. They had to take her up out of here. I want y'all to go listen to Song Cry. Jay-Z is a song called Song Cry. And he talking about, I can't see it coming down my eyes, but I got to make this song cry. What I, The reason why I'm talking about this is whoever Twin Flame, Divine Masculine that I'm picking up on, this Divine Masculine chose a karmic lifestyle. This karmic, this Divine Masculine is not even divine no more. This masculine is on the run with their karmic feminine. This, this, all I can say is I don't want to go no more. I have to quit. This divine masculine is going to die. Either they're going to end up paralyzed from the waist down. This feminine that they're tied to, they're going to die from an overdose or something like that. But there's a bunch of death. A lot of people finna die. 